In 1.2, what we try and do is answer you the question, why should I even bother programming at all? And really what it boils down to is expertise and expertise in an organization. Not everybody is going to be a subject matter expert in everything, right? So you are going to go to an industry, whatever that industry might be. That industry might be education, that industry might be healthcare, that industry might be, you know, engineering, that industry might be, it doesn't really matter, finance. Um, and you are going to bring with you an expertise, right? And that expertise here for Java is going to be Java programming and what you're going to do is you're going to interface you are going to start talking with people whose expertise is not programming so you're going to go into healthcare and you're going to help program something um, that's going to work with nurses that's going to work with doctors that's going to work with patients and what you are not going to need to be in that case is a doctor and the flip side of that is the doctors aren't going to need to be developers as well. So your role in this, this whole interaction is going to be to take somebody else's expertise and translate that with your expertise into something of a new system, a new way for them to be able to interact with clients, with doctors, with, 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 with sick people, whatever the case might be. So you bring an expertise to the table. So you will go to the finance industry and you don't need to be a mortgage lender because you'll be able to take what a mortgage lender needs to know and you'll be able to translate that into Java, which will then translate into a new program or a new portion of a program that that mortgage lender is going to be able to use or that somebody who's going to look for a mortgage is going to be able to use. So programming really truly is, and this is not just, can I call it academic bullcrap? This is not just me being like, it's in the book, I believe this too, because I wouldn't do that. Um, but I really do mean this, is your position as a developer is like the fulcrum point that an, uh, an organization or an industry is going to need because you are the entity that is able to translate the knowledge that's inside of the organization. It's going to be able to translate to the knowledge they're looking to express someplace else inside or outside of the organization. And really the only entity that's going to be capable of doing that is you as a developer. So charge more. 